This is a demonstration of the DEF 47 microphone that I built uh, about a year ago, maybe a year and a half ago, uh, using parts sourced from all over the world. Uh, the circuit board was manufactured by Danny Bouchard in Quebec. Uh, it's the, the DEF 47 circuit, which is a modified version of the, uh, the U47 circuit from Neumann. Uh, that's been optimized to uh, work well with uh, Telefunken EF800 and EF802 tubes, I believe, as well as EF80 tubes made by um, companies like uh, Mullard. Uh, and the tube currently in this microphone is a Telefunken EF800 tube. Um, and when I sell it, I will include... Uh, various other tubes that I've put in the microphone uh, over the time that I've used it uh, to varying effect. Um, the capsule is a Tiersch Blue Line M7 made by Siegfried Tiersch uh, in Austria, I believe. The transformer is an AMI T47 transformer. Uh, the body and grill were machined by Spencer Horton in England. And the PSU was also made by AMI. Um, and the, uh, the body, I, I think, was, uh, is, is one of the more unique features of this microphone. It doesn't follow um, the strict definitions of a U47. It's, um, it's a little bit less uh, wide. And the positioning of the capsule in the grill is not uh, dead center in the microphone, so uh, I've only been using it for cardioid uh, vocal work, um, but you could potentially rewire this microphone to work with uh, omnidirectional or figure eight patterns as well. Um, here's a little demonstration of some singing using the microphone. Um, I have a pretty soft voice, but hopefully this will give you an idea. Raindrops keep falling in my head But that doesn't mean my eyes will soon be turning red Raindrops keep falling, raindrops keep falling on my head Time I knew you when you were young you had the world by the hem of its dress Time I know you now that you're one You have the world lining up to confess Time I'll know you up to the paw Anthropocene turning cold on the stone Time who knows what leads to the paw Will you end in a crowd or end all alone? This microphone is running through a Hairball Audio Copper preamp. Um, I'm not driving it very hard, um, and there is no additional processing, um, no dynamics processing, no compression or limiting or anything like that. Uh, so hopefully this gives you a good idea of how the microphone works. And um, thank you for your interest.